Former shelter dog is now fighting crime and stopping child predators in Manatee County. Sheriff's deputies trained the dog to find hard drives and computer devices that are storing child pornography. News Channelist John Rogers joining us now live in Manatee County tonight to tell us a little bit more about this. So, John, she's uh, one of a handful of dogs, really, in the entire world capable of doing this sort of thing. Yeah, that's right, Keith. That's why this is such a big deal. Officials here tell me there are probably around only 10 dogs in the entire world that are capable of doing this. But none of those dogs likely have the backstory that Gia does. Check. For this shepherd mix named Gia, it's all a game. But she's actually providing a valuable service. She's helping to stop child predators. Check. She's trained to find hidden computer hard drives, flash drives, and SD cards that may contain child porn. Pedophiles often stash away these incriminating devices, and she's one of a handful of dogs in the entire world that's trained to find them. She's like using a flashlight in a dark room because you just want that extra tool to kind of help you. But Manatee County deputies say she's one of a kind because she's a former shelter dog. Last summer, detectives decided to adopt their new deputy to save money and help the local pet population, and officials felt confident they could train her. When you're starting to deal with just odor work, you're using a function of the dog that all dogs have, which is that capability of smelling. <laughs> Gia was a stray who was dropped off at the Bishop Animal Shelter. She was more on the timid side because she didn't know what to what was going on or why she was suddenly in this kennel. But once adopted, she learned quickly. Now she's already working with detectives on child porn investigations. And she's needed because finding a small flash drive in a large house is next to impossible. It's not realistic to think that a, a human can come in and find that. Gia went from living on the streets to getting criminals off the streets. Once they're adopted, they, they really do blossom into what they were truly meant to be. One of the reasons there are so few canines like this across the country or around the world is because it's a relatively new field. But officials tell me it really gained prominence last year because dogs like this were used in the uh, search for, of Jared Fogel's home in Indiana, Keith. Well, John, are they planning to turn more shelter dogs like this into canines? Uh, they hope so. This has been very successful. Even the FBI has contacted Manatee County Sheriff's Office to learn more about this. So they do hope to uh, uh, use more shelter dogs for this, hopefully, this venture in the future. That sounds like a great idea. Great plan. Thank you. John Rogers reporting live for us.